My name is Mario Souza and I'm a Portuguese fine pixel artist in Madrid, Spain. And after a period of almost 20 years in the corporate world, I had lost my passion for work and I felt it was time for a change in my life. In 2016, I decided to take a sabbatical year to think about uh, where I wanted to go. And after more than one year of uh, artistic discovery, I felt that I wanted to combine my long-time passion for quantum physics and quantum mechanics with photography, programming and traditional drawing and painting techniques. Light is a specific range of electromagnetic waves uh, that exist in the universe and color is just uh, an interpretation of the human brain uh, of those same set of uh, electromagnetic waves. That's my main uh, tool, let's say, combine the proper uh, tones of colors, of primary colors, to try to recreate uh, the, the photograph and try to represent uh, the best that I can light and quantum mechanics. My analogical artwork requires a specific set of different paper and hardware calibration that would exhibit the same observing experience of my artwork in digital form. So I don't mix any primary colors. Uh, so every, every photograph only has a red, a green or a blue pixel. The final printed version of my work is very difficult to try to print on, a, on, a, on, a, on paper because uh, it only uses primary colors, so uh, because I don't uh, use secondary colors in my work, so um, I had over this past year and a half, I had to work with proprietary technology to try to find the right definition of balance between uh, hardware calibration and paper uh, to try to print my, my artwork. The photography after it's printed, it goes through a drying period where uh, I allow the, the ink uh, on the paper to dry and, and afterwards I attempt to preserve the, the photography uh, with protective spray which adds a, a ultraviolet protection to the, to the photography on paper uh, to attempt to preserve the, the color as much as I can. Photography is issued with a, with a certificate of authenticity, so depending on the editions, so I have uh, open editions, limited editions and collector's editions. Each photography is signed by me um, and additionally the certificate uh, the digital certificate of authenticity is also issued uh, with the photography. After the photography is printed on paper, um, I use uh, fine art photography conservation techniques uh, such as archive paper and also archive uh, boxes to try to preserve uh, the photography. Each photography is uh, unique in the physical interactivity that it has with the, with the viewer uh, because it's the observer that paints the photograph when they observe the, the physical photography on paper.
what I wanted to create with my artwork is when the, the observer observes the artwork in analogical form to have the same observing experience that they have in digital form.